time. Let's see how to fix the Google Nest Hub Max photo frame showing blank screen or not loading images. Are you experiencing the issues with the Google Nest Hub Max photo frame showing a blank screen or not showing the images? Don't worry, you're not alone. Many users have reported encountering this problem and it can be frustrating when you display your favorite photos. In this particular video, we'll see how to fix the Google Nest Hub Max photo frame showing the black screen or not loading the images. If your Google Nest Hub Max photo frame is showing a blank screen or not loading images, there are some reasons. Okay, whenever you face this kind of error, you see the screen like this. The first method is check your internet connection. Make sure that the Google Nest Hub is Max. Max is connected to the stable Wi-Fi network. If your internet connection is weak or unstable, your photo frame may not load images properly. The second method is reboot your device. Sometimes a simple reboot can fix the issue. To reboot your Google Nest Hub Max, unplug it from the power source and wait for a few seconds and then plug it back in. The third method is clear caches in the data. Clearing the caches in the data Google Home app may also help in the fix the problem. Okay, so in order to do that, go open the Google Home app on your smartphone or the tablet, tap on the Google Nest Hub Max device, tap on the settings icon in the top right corner, scroll down and tap on app and notification. Tap on see all your apps, find the Google Go map and tap on it. Tap on storage and caches, tap on clear storage and then clear caches. The fourth method is reset your device. If none of the above solutions work, then try resetting your Google Nest Hub Max to its factory settings. Keep in mind that resetting your device will erase all the data and settings. So make sure to back up any important data before proceeding it. Okay, so what you can do is let's swipe down from the top screen to access the quick settings menu. The settings menu from the top right corner, device settings, reset device, follow the on-screen instruction to reset your device. Okay, so that's all about this. Thank you.